in this video we're looking at mulberries mulberries now grow in the philippines but before when i was young there were no mulberries in the philippines so i really did not think that it could grow in the Philippines. So I have this belief that if it grows in America, it cannot grow in Asia because of the temperature differences. And this proved erroneous. so there are so many beliefs we have in life and within this word belief is a lie b lie f well of course the f stands for something if you give it a particular word that you can put together but The important thing here is that we have to investigate our beliefs because if it is uh, an erroneous belief or a belief that is not true, a belief that is not backed up by common sense well there's no use of having a belief if it is erroneous and if it is lacking in common sense going back to the belief I had with the mulberries so uh, when I, I um when I am doing this recording, I know that mulberries now grow in the Philippines. Um, and it matters because that is a proof that my beliefs aren't re aren't real they cannot be depended on they um they are not based on common sense so a, a so the basis of having it is questionable You know, in um, relationships also, there are so many beliefs like um, for a woman, it's like, okay, this guy, I believe this guy is good. I believe this guy is dependable. I believe. <laughs> and so because of all these beliefs in our head, there's this desire that um, comes out for the guy. But that's all beliefs. It has to be backed up by reason, um, by common sense. my proofs um, if this guy is dependable what is that one thing that made you say that if it is because one day you were
um, having problems with money and be given money, that's that's not enough proof that he is dependable because it can be just in that moment. I would rather forgive myself for beliefs rather than hanging on to them. That's my process. I don't know about yours, but with me, I release my beliefs and I look at common sense and what is best for all so that that straightens the way i look at things